Model evaluation and selection is an essential step in machine learning and data science to ensure that the chosen model performs well on unseen data. Real-time technology introduces additional considerations for model evaluation, as it often requires efficient and quick predictions. Here's a general process for evaluating and selecting models in the context of real-time technology. Define evaluation metrics. Start by defining the evaluation metrics that are most relevant to your problem and business objectives. Common metrics include accuracy, precision, recall, F1, score, and area under the ROC curve. Additionally, for real-time applications, you may consider metrics like latency and throughput to assess the speed and efficiency of predictions. Split the data. Divide your dataset into three subsets, training, validation, and test. The training set is used to train the models, the validation set is used for hyperparameter tuning and model selection, and the test set is reserved for final evaluation. The typical split ratio is 70 to 80% for training, 10 to 15% for validation, and 10 to 15% for testing. In real-time scenarios, ensure that the test set includes data that represents the real-time environment as closely as possible. Select candidate models. Choose a set of candidate models that are suitable for your problem, considering the specific requirements of real-time technology. These models could include various algorithms such as decision trees, random forests, support vector machines, neural networks, or ensemble methods. Pay attention to the computational complexity and inference speed of each model. Train and tune models. Train each candidate model on the training set and tune their hyperparameters using the validation set. Hyperparameters control the behavior and performance of the model, such as the learning rate, regularization strength, or the number of layers in a neural network. Use techniques like grid search, random search, or Bayesian optimization to find the optimal hyperparameters. Evaluate model performance. Evaluate each model's performance on the test set using the defined evaluation metrics. Measure both the predictive accuracy and the real-time efficiency of the models. Compare the results to identify the models that achieve the best balance between prediction quality and speed. Fine-tune and optimize. If none of the models meet the desired performance or real-time requirements, consider additional steps to fine-tune and optimize the selected models. This could involve feature engineering, data pre-processing, model architecture modifications, or deploying more advanced techniques like model compression or quantization to reduce model size and improve inference speed. Validate in a real-time environment. Once you have selected a model that performs well in offline evaluation, it's crucial to validate its performance in a real-time environment. Deploy the model to a test environment that simulates the production environment as closely as possible. Monitor the model's behavior, latency, and overall performance. Make necessary adjustments if any issues arise. Remember that model evaluation and selection is an iterative process. It may involve going back to previous steps, exploring different models, or adjusting parameters to achieve the desired performance in real-time scenarios.